Hi, I am Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this video, you will learn how to create smart art radial list in PowerPoint 2016. One of the common slide types that is used in any presentation is a numbered list. Unfortunately, most of the numbered lists are mind-numbingly boring like this. Naturally, the moment someone looks at a slide like this, which is totally intimidating, you can expect them to switch off immediately. Fortunately, there is a way to present the same numbered list in a more visually interesting fashion like this one. This option is available in PowerPoint 2016 and I'm going to show you how you can create this beautiful radial list from scratch. The first thing I'm going to do is to go to Insert, Smart Art, and since it is a list, there is a natural tendency for you to look for the graphic under List. Unfortunately, there is no option like that here. You need to find the list option, the radial list option under relationships. And when you go all the way down, you will find the option here and you can say OK and you will have the radial list available. The way PowerPoint envisions you to use the radial list is like this, where you have one subtitle text and the associated explanation here. I'm not going to use it like that. I'm going to use it as just the subtitle and I'm going to use these elements to write my numbers. So I'm going to select these and you might already know how to promote something in the next level to the previous level. You go to the option called promote after selecting the bullet point here and immediately there is one new thing that is added and I'm going to do the same thing for the next one. So you can see that one, two, three, four things are already there and we are going to add promote one more and promote one more. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that is all we want. So we can select everything else and delete it. So I'm going to just hit delete backspace backspace. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's all and it's very beautiful. Now I'm going to say one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And now the numbers are ready. And I'm going to go here and I'm going to change the colors like this. And of course, I can always uh, replace this with an icon. So I go to work offline and I'm going to pick up any icon like this and I'm going to say insert. Now we have an icon. So this, of course, needs to be chosen very carefully according to the subject that you are about to explain. So I am just showing you an example of any random icon here. So you have the icon and that is leading to seven different points and the rest is formality. All you need to do is to use text box to complete your graphic like this. You just write your text and place it right next to each of the uh, bullet points here. So that is how you create a beautiful radial list using SmartArt in PowerPoint 2016. Now I'm going to show you some creative alternatives to numbered list taken from our comprehensive all-in-one PowerPoint bundle. The bundle is a collection of more than 4,020 premium PowerPoint templates. And this is our first example, which talks about three different choices. This is of course a numbered list, but it has a very different look and feel to it rather than the boring uh, list that you would normally see in a business presentation. Another example is this one where we use the icon that signifies the way that we normally represent numbers using our fingers. So as you can see here, this one indicates number one, two, three, four. It's a very interesting way in which you can represent your numbers. And the next example is the animated version here. You can write your checklist here and then you can have each of these ticked out as soon as you complete explaining that particular fact. And we have this beautiful icon which comes and marks that tick. The next example is that of alternating highlight on click. As you can see here, this is a numbered list and the actual text is slightly grayed out. On a click, I draw the viewer's attention to the first point and then I draw the attention to the second one, third one, fourth one and fifth one. As you can see, this is a very interesting way to represent your numbered list. An interesting alternative to this is our sliding highlight between numbers. On the first click, we bring in all these boxes that create a sense of anticipation in the minds of your audience. And then on a click, we get our first point moved to the next one. As you can see here, the highlight is brought to the second point. 
and then we draw the viewer's attention to the third point, fourth, fifth, and sixth. So that is how this beautiful uh, template works. Now, as you can see, these are some of the simple examples from our comprehensive all-in-one PowerPoint bundle. This bundle is a collection of templates from our best-selling templates packs like CEO Pack 1, CEO Pack 2, Advanced Animations Pack. Here, the kind of animations that are shown is highly advanced and it is not available in any other kind of PowerPoint templates available in the market. Visual PowerPoint Graphs Pack is a collection of data-driven PowerPoint templates which are extremely versatile like these, like bullet charts, goal charts, etc. And we have Flat Design Pack which has flat design templates, hand-drawn graphics pack like this, theme title templates and more than 400 new consulting models and frameworks. I will leave a link to our comprehensive all-in-one PowerPoint bundle in the description area below this video. One more thing, as a thank you for watching this video this far, I am happy to offer you a 5-day email course called 25 Creative PowerPoint Ideas. It is a practical collection of 25 creative ideas that you can implement in your next presentation. And this email course is completely free for you to join. You can click on the link here and you can enroll to this 5-day email course. So click on the link here and I'll see you inside the email course.